Virginia Health Department says they've hired 1,200 people to work as contact tracers since the pandemic hit. The purpose of contact tracing is really to break the chain of transmission. Break the chain by collecting information from people by phone that have tested positive for COVID. They provide resources, tell them to quarantine, and ask them questions like who they've been around. Then contact those people who have possibly been exposed. Since September, the health department says they've attempted to call 57% of the cases, which is equal to 240,000 people. They say the other 43% either live in places like prisons, long-term living facilities, or the health department didn't have the manpower to contact them due to the overwhelming number of cases. Of that total, 36% of people provided contacts to the health department. The others either didn't have contacts to report, refused to give the information, or don't know it. They say the information collected is confidential and not shared with anyone outside the health department. Our main aim is to provide information, education to cases, to close contacts, provide recommendations to them to prevent future spread of illness, and we have their best interest in mind. They say monitoring the data and warning people of potential exposure helps keep the community safe. So I think it's, it's really critical to let, you know, let the public know that we want to work together, that you know, contact tracing only works if the public is working with public health and realizing that contact tracing is only one piece in the puzzle. Continue to wear masks, wash hands, and get your vaccine when, when your time comes as well. I'm Margaret Cavanaugh for News 3.